to hide your cancer a very very good evening to you guys this is anjali tarot and this is a general mid monthly reading for all the cancer sun moon venus rising from 15 till the 30th of november 2024 i am going to tap into a recent past current energies and near future and we will see the guidance as usual starting with the overall energy for the rest of the month of november 2024 and uh, it's not a love reading or current reading or anything specific but whatever messages will come i will just let you guys know okay and if it's not resonating it's not your story you can just skip the video so let's start if uh, you want to be a professional tarot card reader like me you can start your journey by purchasing my course the link is in the description box for the same if you want to start your self healing journey with hope on opono but don't know from where to start you can definitely start by purchasing my master class again the link is in the description box for the same and it has the power to change your life uh, for the rest of your life trust me on that i'm doing it from a very very long time now and um, if you want a one on one healing sessions or personal readings you can check out the description box and you can mail me for the same so let's start let's see okay overall energy for cancer people for the rest of the month of uh, november 2024 is let's see we have the queen of pentacles so taking care of yourself your money your job your career kind and compassionate and nurturing kind of energy towards yourself first of all and then towards others as well so it's like a motherly kind of caring nurturing and compassionate kind of energy that you are going to uh uh imbibe in yourself uh, for the rest of the month of november 2024 let's see in the recent past what was happening we had the death and rebirth something ended here something shifted uh, in you big 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 time like a major transformation happened because of a separation or breakup or some kind of uh, change was there internal shift was there that uh, felt like a rebirth to you okay now in the current scenario we have the knight of cups you are full of love full of love if you did something wrong with somebody you are in this energy of uh, going towards them and uh, uh, repairing the things with them and or you are in this energy of having your heart chakra open towards uh, every possibility and everything that's coming your way in a very compassionate and loving way by the end of this month we have the temperance you are going to be very very patient with everything and everyone that's coming your way let's clarify these cards one by one and let's get the clear picture of what's going on let me see in the recent past what was happening we had the 8 of swords the page of cups and the 8 of pentacles So okay it was a, a, not a, a death of a connection or a situation or relationship or something like that it was a death of overthinking so you like listen to your heart and you started working in a direction where your heart was pulling you to go in right so you were putting in the effort and energy in a direction where you felt like your heart is kind of taking you organically and naturally and you felt like you should uh, you should uh, just close the chapter of overthinking just uh, close the chapter of continuously thinking negative about a particular person or situation and you were keeping your heart chakra open your energy is open and putting in the effort and energy in a direction where your your heart was pulling you in right now it could be work situation it could be love situation it could be anything that your heart was kind of telling you to go ahead in the in a particular situation or direction knight of cups so basically your heart is uh, completely open wide open and you're like okay bring it on kind of energy in a very kind and compassionate kind of a way not in this way of okay my goodness bring it on and i will say no you're like okay universe whatever is meant for me whatever is good for me bring it on i am ready to handle it with love and care two of pentacles two of swords the knight of pentacles so because you are not able to see the clear picture of the situation in front of you you are not able to see the clear path clear direction of a situation in front of you but you are ready to walk on that path right so you are like whatever is good for you or whatever is meant for you is going to remain with you whatever is not meant for you or whatever is not good for you is going to uh, be left behind naturally and organically so you are in this energy of slowly but surely heading towards things people situation connections and energies that are good for you although you don't know the path although you are not able to see the clear picture of what's ahead of you you are just uh, keeping your energies open keeping your uh, hopes a uh, positive and moving in that direction slowly but steadily right so by the end of this month temperance a lot of patience a lot of good uh, vibes uh, good energies and healing a lot of healing temperance is card of healing as well let me clarify the temperance we have the four of swords the queen of pentacles the lovers a connection is going to be healed 
a connection between you and a particular person is going to be healed a situation that was unhealed that was left uh, up in the air that was not uh, that much good in the past is going to be healed so i do see major healing coming in a connection in a friendship in a relationship in a situation where things were not going well between you and a particular person or energy because you are going to make the choice and the decision of repairing things with a particular person or situation you will be able to do that slowly but surely one day at a time kind of a deal so it's like a it's not like a out of the blue everything is going to be fine within a situation within a dynamic no but one day with 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 this kind of dynamic of with this kind of energy of one day at a time you are going to be able to repair something with a very important person with a very important energy that you were not able to do in the past with your patience with your this attitude of okay universe please help me to move in this direction with your self healing self love self care and you uh spreading the, those kind of energies outward as well so you are going to attract healing powers and healing energies towards you in a major 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 way and you will be able to repair maybe multiple connections or multiple energies but one in specific one in particular is going to be there that is going to repair be repaired and that is going to be healed and it's going to give you a lot of sense of relief and lot of sense of contentment again it's not going to happen just like that it's going to take time but it's going to be the initiation of a healing uh, a healing uh, a journey between you and a particular situation or specific person or specific situation or situations but one in particular is very very important that you are going to repair with somebody with a magnetic power of healing and patience very good very very good so the thing that you are stressed out might be right now is going to be resolved by the end of this month all you have to do is to keep your energies open have the, the surrender and trust mode and keep going ahead self love self care self healing plus um spreading that energy outwards boom you are naturally going to attract those kind of energies of repairing and healing multiple things multiple situations and one specific that i am getting again and again let's see the guidance for you guys cancer we have the queen of wands okay do not forget to take care of yourself in this uh, time period uh yes it's definitely fine to have this uh, to give this love and care and everything to other people as well but do not forget to take care of yourself as well it's very very important to start with yourself be in love with yourself uh, be the uh, the person who attracts not to chase not to cry not to beg attracts okay in a very very positive way not in a you know a negative attitude i can attract anything no not like that universe keeps on uh, works on energies and frequencies and you can't uh, manipulate the universal energies no matter what no matter how smart you are okay you can't so just take care of yourself love yourself and be in that uh, love zone and love kind of energy first be the love first and you will attract love naturally towards you naturally and organically so yeah thank you so much for tuning in cancer i'll see you soon in the next video bye bye take care god bless you namaste